Caribbean nationals all across the country are being urged to fill in their origin under Question 8 of the 2010 Census Forms. The forms will be mailed to households beginning next March. Carib ID, the movement founded by Felicia Passad to get Caribbean nationals counted, says all must fill out the forms so no money is left at the table. Carib ID recently joined top officials from the New York, New Jersey Census Office as well as the coordinators from the New York City Census Office at an April 1st kickoff, one year ahead of the April 2010 Census. Caribbean nationals across the country are being urged to get on board the movement to ensure the community is accurately counted and can get its slice of the more than $300 billion pie. If you want money for education, health care, immigration services, sponsorship and advertising funding, it all starts with the census, said Passad. Nationals interested in becoming ambassadors in the process are urged to log on to CaribID2010.com. President Barack Obama is set to spend two nights in the twin island of Trinidad and Tobago later this month. Obama will attend the fifth Summit of the Americas, his White House advisor for the Summit of the Americas said this week. Ambassador Jeffrey S. Davidow said the president will attend the April 17th through 19th summit, with some of his main concerns being the global economy and equity, as well as climate change. Two Caribbean nationals were among 13 people shot down by a crazed gunman in Binghamton, New York. The two were a Haitian couple, Mark Anthony Bernard, 44, and Maria Sonia Bernard, 46. Both were at the American Civic Center to learn English and lived in Etticott, New York. They are survived by two children, ages 6 and 12. CONCACAF President Trinidad-born Jack Warner will return to his seat on the FIFA Executive Committee. Warner was again nominated without opposition to the world body's most powerful panel. He will formally begin his new term at the conclusion of the FIFA Congress in the Bahamas on June 3rd. For more Caribbean news, log on to caribworldnews.com for your daily updates. And that concludes our News of the Week. Up next, our community calendar and entertainment news.